Hi, uh, yo, what's up YouTube? We're back. This one's going to be kind of more of the rant video in the way about this, right? So I made a video about the economist, an economic lesson, right? If you've watched the economic lesson, you will know exactly what I mean, right? So for example, I'm going to pull up the article again, right? So you know this, right? This is the article, right? Selling goods, right? You know, if you are, this was 1st of January, right? Um, on Vinted. Right, collectors. Now, if you're on vintage, you're selling your used clothes, right? That's what you'd be selling, your used clothes, right? Collectibles on eBay, so that's going to be, right, fucking Pokemon cards, you know, fucking Yu-Gi-Oh's and whatever, right? Collectibles. I love how they think that you're making beer money on this shit. It makes me laugh, right? And then to Airbnb, profits will be under this and blah, blah, blah. Right, so, the reason why that... Right, so basically, like I said about the economic video, right? Has them giving us this money, right? Right, I'm going to do this because this, this money I'm going to spend, right? So they give them, right, they giving us this money, right? And then taking it back off us in tax is fucking outdated. It's outdated, right? It's fucking stupid, right? It makes, it makes me laugh that this even, like, you could go to be a, go work a job, right? You'll go work a job, right? Like, everyone goes and works a job, right? No matter what you do, everyone works a job, yeah? Most people work jobs. The people that say that they're not employed and whatever, right? Most of them, if they're not multi-millionaires, like Tate, where he's got fucking man giving him 50 quid a week, right? Or 50 quid a month, and he's got a 1,000 fucking 200,000 subscribers giving him 50 quid a month, right? To join his team, and then he's got a team of people working to help these people out. Then yeah, okay, fair enough, right? This guy's going to be a millionaire, and he don't gonna he don't gonna have to go hi boss. But most people have to say hi boss, right? So you get paid at the end of the week, and then basically these te these take this money back off you. So they give you this money, and then they take it back off you, and then they give this money, and they take it back off you. But the thing is, they print the money, right? They print the money, so they give you the money, right? They give you the money, so they print more money. So for them to take the money back off you, why don't they just fucking print more money? This is what I mean. This is why the system is a scam, yeah? And, right, so what made me laugh in this article, right, was basically when they said, right, oh, if you're, right, if you're selling, what was it? If you were selling a fucking camera or some shit, right, let me go to my fucking mate's chat. All right, anyone selling used clothes, right, used clothes just remember just remember that used clothes so let's say this i've got bought this black jumper right and i bought this for say i bought this off ebay i think for like fucking 10.99 right i think i bought this for it's plain black i don't wear branded clothes like all the hats that i have made are fucking like you know i even write silly shit on them myself and get them printed like the living man because that's what we are right we're not a fucking person if you say to someone they're a person right you are not a fucking person you are a man yeah or a woman yeah a person is a fucking corporation right you are not a corporation you are a living man that's that explains the hat right so if anyone didn't know that right so you know I'm I'm one of them people that is awoke is awakened to the system, right? I know it's a fucking scam. I see it, yeah, with my own eyes, right? I don't need somebody to tell me it's like that, right? Because I am a visionary, right? So, for example, let's say it says door selling a fucking a camera, an old camera equipment, old camera equipment, right? So let's say, for example, you walk into the store. You walk into the store, right? You go, get your 500 pounds. This is not 500 pounds, but we're basically saying 500 pounds. Get your 500 pounds, right? You walk in, you come out, your brand new cam, yeah? Brand new camera, right? You go down the street and you're taking pictures, right? Because you're testing it out. You're taking pictures of fucking any old shit, right? You know, taking a picture of your house, your roof, you know, your, your garden, right? Taking a picture of your dad, your mum. Right, and all this shit, right, or your best mates when you're having a picture, right? So you're on the cam for, at camera for like five years. You paid five hundred pounds for it. So when you made the purchase, they took money off the purchase, yeah. The company that you bought the money off, they took money off the company, right, and gave it to the tax, the government back, right? So they took money off it. They took money off it, they took money off it, 
you know, they sold, the shop might have made £350 if you bought it for £500, right? Because the rest has gone to this and this. But they actually made money on the camera, right? They actually made money selling the camera, right? So then you get the camera, you get another thousand pound, and you go buy another fucking camera. Now, the other camera that you bought, right, the, the one you sold, is fucking shit. You're like, no, oh, this one's fucking shit. I'm going to sell it, right? So you sell it. You've sold it at a loss, right? Because you bought it at 500, right? So you sold it at 250. So how the fuck can they turn around and say that you need to pay us again? Your job, that your job, right, that you go to work at, took the tax off you then, right? Then when you bought the camera, you know, that's the tax off the camera, right? The, the shop took the tax off the camera and then they want tax off you again for reselling it at a loss. Come on, man. That's a fucking piss take, yeah? That's 60%. This is why the UK is fucking shit, right? The UK is a joke, right? And this is why the system is outdated. Because I tell you one thing, when my family's not around, right, whatever... I'm fucking out of here, mate. I'm di I'm going, bro. I'm not fucking dealing with this shitty country no more. And if anyone turns around and says to me, what am I when you need a fucking operation? Everyone pays for the fucking NHS, bro. Everyone pays national insurance, you know. So for anyone to turn around and say, when you need an operation, bro, you get your money, you, put, you get another bank, you put the money in the bank, right, or you put the money in crypto, right, or in Bitcoin or Litecoin, right, this is why private selling yeah, is going to be so much more important, but operating outside of the system, right? And what I mean by operating outside of the system is not taking this fucking bullshit, right? It's not taking this fucking note with a queen's face on it, right? Not taking this fucking note with a queen's face on it, right? Because this, this money I've got here, yeah, is getting fucking spent, right? It's getting spent, I'm getting rid of it. There's not even a lot there anyway. Right? It looks like a lot because it's in fives, but it's not. Right? So it's like the principle of it, yeah, is you're gonna, I'm gonna basically use the money, right? And then I'm gonna spend it, right? And I'm gonna buy Litecoin and I'll put Litecoin in a wallet, right? And put it in a wallet, right? Straight out of the fucking system. Because the system is a peer to peer cashless currency without the interference of a bank or a government. Right? That's exactly what Bitcoin stands for. Right? That's exactly what Bitcoin stands for. Right? So I'm not being funny, but private selling right now is going to be much more important than using these fucking platforms. Right? Because these platforms, if you're sitting there and you're selling something that is your old shit, it's at your house, you might have bought a chair, right? Let's say your chair. Let's say a chair. Yeah, I bought this chair for 300 pounds. If I sold this chair, I'm not going to get £300 for it, am I? Right? I bought it like five years ago. I probably get like 150 for it. Probably not even that. Probably like £50 because it's fucking used and no one will give you the money for it. Right? Because everyone has this shop cost. Right? It's not shop cost. So if you sell this, you telling me that these fuckers want 20 quid off the sale of this. No, 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 no. That's got to stop, yeah? So the only way that you're going to sell this without the scrutiny of that, right, is to sell it in fucking cash, yeah? You either deal with people in cash, paper, right, this fucking paper bullshit. I wouldn't even rather take this paper bullshit, right? Litecoin, right? Send Litecoin to each other. This is why I need like, um, you know, like a Telegram group, right? Should have a Telegram group, right? Pioneers, pioneers it should be fucking called, right? The pioneers that operate outside of the system, yeah? We don't take cash money, right? We don't take fiat money, right? We take fucking Litecoin, right? And then when someone wants something, right, or whatever, you private message them, right? And you say, yo, uh, I want this, right? It's like, I've got a Vaporium, got it on eBay. I'm not selling on PSA through eBay anymore. See, fucking selling PSA through eBay is a fucking joke. The fees are ridiculous anyway. And when the card, when you're not even making money back on the card, or you're not even making anything on the card, it's just fucking pointless, bro. It's pointless, right? So, Litecoin, right? Is the best fucking coin out there to send to each other with no fees because it's got stability yeah it's stable right it might go right now I like the price yeah price is 58 quid then it goes to 50 51 52 53 60 and it's 64 65 you know and then it's 
50, 52, 55, 56. So it, it's fucking, it, it, it doesn't rock around a lot. Yeah, it's stable. It, it's a stable coin, right? The US dollar's up and fucking down like a pogo stick. 78, 60, fucking 72, 75, 78, 76. And then if you send like USDC coin, yeah, it's fucking ridiculous fees. So it's fucking shit, right? It's a shit coin. Solana's a shit coin, right? Because it gets dumped. It's a shit coin. So if you want to make money and buy a shit coin and then sell it, that's completely up to you, right? And then, you know, same thing with like, uh, what other, what other ones are they? You got fucking Doge. Doge is fucking bullshit. It's a load of nonsense. That's all nonsense as well, right? Basically, it's fucking printed forever, right? Don't have a limited supply, right? It's not fucking script. It's a script coin, but it just keeps producing blocks all the time. It's rubbish, right? So the, the only way that you, if you, if you don't want this scrutiny, right? Because it's it's fucking bullshit. If you if you in, in the eyes of me and you look at it, even my dad said to him and said to me, he's like, this is fucking nonsense. He's like, how the fuck can you go to work, get your money taxed, then you you buy some it, it gets taxed, and then when you sell some it, they want to take that money off you again, even if you're selling it at a loss. Like, Brett, are they taking the piss? Like. So I'd sit, you'd sit there and argue it all day long. Be like, no, 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 no. That's why this becomes much more important by operating outside of the system. That's what you have to do. Yeah, it's operate outside of the system. The whole reason why Bitcoin was created was to be fucking transferred to people without this bullshit, right? But people seem to think that oh, oh, I've got to sell it for pounds or dollars. Right? And then you're giving the government capital gains and fucking this bullshit. Right? No, 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 no. You buy it, you don't sell it. You wait for them to print the money to fucking oblivion where it's not worth anything. And then you'll be like, ha ha, yo, you fucking losers. We're making this new thing. Right? And then you make the rules because you're all the money holders. You're all, you're all the ones with the assets. They can't do anything then. And then you hold all the assets. Right? So, you know, buy fucking Litecoin. Take it off an exchange, put it in a private wallet and fucking send it to each other. That's what you should be doing, right? Because you need to operate outside of the system. That's why private selling is going to be much more important than this bullshit. Because if this is how they want to play this stupid fucking game, right? Then, you know, the rule makers, it's about keeping you poor. That's what it is about. Yeah, it's about keeping you poor. They don't want you with any money in your pocket. They want you to be relied on the system. So even if you make like like this, right? I paid eleven hundred for this. Yeah, it's a video piece. That's what I put. I, I've got it as a video piece, right? I got it as a video piece, you know, because I represent the website that I got it from, right? So it's a represent piece. I got discount. I got money off it, right? So it would have been fourteen. I paid eleven. Right, so you know it's better, right? It's better. It's a skeleton. It's a fucking full mother of pearl dial, yeah. So every day rotates as the month rotates, and the under twenty four hour time rotates. You know, it's a it's a good piece, right? It's stainless steel, right? It's not a precious metal, right? So I'm not bothered about the price, right? But if I was to sell this, right, you telling me they want more money on this? No fucking chance. Like, if I'm going to sell this and I'm going to sell it, you bought it for a grand and I sell it for 800, I am not paying you any money out of that. No, 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 no. So go fuck yourself, right? Because I didn't make money on it. If I made fucking two grand on it, then I'd pay you the div the, the, the fucking, the rest of it, yeah, or, you know, the 200 or whatever I made extra, right? But I'm keeping the rest. Do you know what I mean? The rest is for me. The rest is for your fucking survival. Do you know what I mean? So there's a couple of videos that... This could be made of because it, it's fucking bullshit. Because you know what they're going to do probably next. They're probably going to come for them YouTubers that are making this big dollar. That's what they're probably going to do. Right. Thanks for watching the video. I don't make money on YouTube. So if you like the button, you know, you know what? We're going to do something different. Right? We're going to do like a fucking outro. Yeah. <laughs>